Hey, what's going on out there in this great land of YouTube? It's Jack. Today's topic, the periodic table of elements. And I'm going at you with the number 99. Check it out. It's called Einsteinium. And Einsteinium was actually called that because when they discovered this, they wanted to name it after Albert Einstein. I've got seven key factors about what this element is. And let's go on with the show check it out number one this element number 99 it's a synthetic element it's man-made it does not occur naturally on this great planet of earth number two it is incredibly difficult to make and store for even the smartest of the brains on our beautiful planet number three even some of the so-called most profound scientists and brains literally even know nothing or even heard about number 99, the Einsteinium elephant, or element <laughs> that we man-made have made of. Number four, it does have 99 electrons and 99 protons, so cool. Number five, its first discovery was in 1952, and it actually came from the debris of our first atom slash hydrogen bomb. Number six, it's neither a liquid or a solid. In fact, its melting point is literally 860 degrees Celsius, and its boiling point is 996 degrees Celsius. And it also only can be made in nuclear reactors. Number, number seven, man. For each month of the delay on this element, only 7% of Einsteinium disappears. And on that note, I gotta toss the book down and give it to you real. Einsteinium, it's man-made. They figured it out when they went to go discover the debris of a hydrogen bomb. Me in my eyes tells me one thing, there's always protection. Somebody has to protect something or attack another thing. It, if you or me and the people watching begin to love each other one more time, more times than defense and offense. You know, offense is great. Defense is not needed if everybody works together. So I want to say this. Seven points of Einsteinium. There's seven continents. So if you're listening in Europe, if you're listening in Asia, if you're listening in Africa, if you're listening in Antarctica, if you're listening in North America, South America, man, Hopefully, this thing called love will cure the problem of Einsteinium. Now, here's a cool fun fact before I leave all you folks, and I hope you're still watching this. Fun fact about Einsteinism, it literally gives off a blue ray of aura, even to the visible eye. You don't need a microscope when you see this stuff. It's so cool. It's almost like kryptonite or whatever Superman uses. One side, two side, three side, you. Let's become together and no division. So I want to say thanks for everyone that watches this YouTube channel, this video, whether it goes anywhere, whether it doesn't. I care because you know what? I made it and I hope you care too because you listen to it. Remember, when we stand for something, we won't fall for anything. Choose love. Thank you guys. Have a great day.